Hello, everybody. Hope you're having an amazing Wednesday morning. It's time to rise and grind. Stretch those arms out. We're going to stretch the brain this morning. We're going to get you guys excited and motivated. Start sharing this Facebook Live. Let's build up an audience right now. See people joining and joining. What's up, Erica? Las Vegas. How you doing today? Good morning to you. What's up, Joel? Online sales pro. OSP. Got a bunch of people joining this morning. Hey, uh, today is a Facebook Live that I will be sharing some thoughts of the 90 day run. Uh, this Facebook Live is invited for anybody in the industry to join. We're not going to be promoting a specific company or a specific product. Um, this is for you guys to learn about the industry, to get motivated. What's up, Matthias from Germany? Hey, Angelica, PC, calling all the way from India. What's up, Laura from Germany? See everybody on here. Incredible. Thanks for the thumbs up, hearts. I appreciate that, guys. Keep sharing this Facebook Live. I've got some good content for you this morning. But what I was saying was that it doesn't matter what company that you're you're uh, you're you're with. We're not promoting a specific company here. We're just building up the industry, network marketing as professionals. We want to build it up because the bigger we can grow it, uh, the more successful we all will be. So thank you guys for jumping on. What's up, Martin Lauren from Germany? Thanks, guys. We got Sylvia. Who else is joining in? Where are you guys calling in from? Tomek from Poland. I'm always seeing you on here, brother. Good to see you. Let, let everybody know where you guys are calling in from. Let them know your country or your, your city or the state, wherever you're calling in from. I want to show people how this industry is just spread throughout the world and how people are embracing it everywhere worldwide. It's an incredible, incredible industry, guys, right? So in just a, a few seconds, I want to get started on my Facebook Live for you guys this morning. Got some great content for you. What's up, Sylvia? We got Texas in the house. Hey, April. Thaddeus, Germany. What's up, Houston in the house. Kathleen, good to see you again. Glad that you're on here again, plugging away, right? Alex Bulla, what's up? We got Italy in the house. Switzerland in the house. Turkey, what's up, Gokman? Good to see you, brother. Got, got some incredible leaders on the line right now. Shailene, what's up? Johannesburg, huh? That's right. Got South Africa. All right, guys, so good. Let's get this thing started. As we're building on the, on the bottom part of your screen, we've got Spain in the house. On the bottom part of your screen, you can share this Facebook Live with people. Leave comments as I'm, uh, as I'm doing the Facebook Live. I'll try to see if you guys have any questions. I'll answer questions for you guys. When I'm done, what I will do is publish this video to, to my Facebook page. You guys can share it with people. You guys can send them messages to friends. Anybody you think is going to help, it's great, all right? But every Wednesday morning, I'm here doing the thing for this industry to build it up, guys. So tell everybody you know about it. Just tell them to plug in every Wednesday morning. Get their tips for the week so they can give that motivation to fill up their gas tank and go build a big business. So anyways, you guys, okay, good. I'm glad you guys are on. There's a couple different things I want to talk about today. Um, now that we're more than halfway through the 90-day run, congratulations to all you guys who are running and running hard. We're not at the finish line yet, but we're almost there. It is in the distance. If this were a marathon, we would be at about mile marker 20 right now, and you guys are still in the race, so don't worry. All right, you guys are all setting your own pace. Some people are way out in front. Some people are just in, in, uh, just saving their energy. They're ready to put in their kick on the last three or four miles, right? Like any marathon runner. But um, hey, guys, today I want to talk about first about our why, like why it is we we are doing things. You know, most people in this business, when people ask what what do you do for a living, you know, we've always been. I've been trained to say, hey, I'm a professional networker. I'm a professional network marketer, you know? And some people know what network marketing is. Some people think that networking has to do with computers for some reason because we're talking about networking. But when they ask you, well, what it is exactly, what it is that you exactly do, what kind of answer do you have for them? You know, and, and, and your answer really is going to dictate the success you'll have in this business, you know? And uh, most people, they always answer what it is they do exactly. Uh, they, they, they always start from the outside in. They talk about what it is they do, and then they get to how it is they do it, and then very rarely do they get to the most important part, which is why. They always could say what my company is, what exactly we do, and that's it. They don't say why they do it, and they're missing out on the most important part because what you need to understand is that people don't care what you do. They care why you do it. Same thing goes for when you're selling products. Pe people don't care what you're selling. They care why you're selling it. And, and that's what people really want to know. We're all human beings. Everything's tied to emotion, right? So when you understand how to instead start from the outside in and go from the inside out, you're going to be a lot more successful and you're going to get your, your words are going to fall on a lot more of conscious ears rather than just going through one ear and out the other of the person that you're speaking to. Okay. Because people have what it is they do already. They can care less about what it is you do. But when you start t getting to the core of what it is you're doing, which is why, 
then they're going to want to listen more and they're going to want to, they're going to be inspired. See, there are people that inspire people to do things and there are people that don't. And the people that inspire people to do things lead from their heart. They have a reason why they do things. There's real passion behind what they do. There's a purpose. There's a service behind what they're doing. And people are attracted to that. They're more attracted to helping people when they know why it is they're doing something than, rather than what it is they're doing. Okay? It's the same that goes for when you're at, in the United States. You know, there are times during the year when I go to the grocery store. And I walk out of the grocery store and there's little kids there and they're selling candy bars. Or they're following me to my car in the parking lot saying, Hey sir, would you like to buy a candy bar? Pick a candy bar, any candy bar. You know, most of the time I'm like, no, thank you. You know, I'm not interested right now. No, thank you. But there are times when I walk outside of the store and there are people that, that come up to me, kids that come up to me and say, hello, sir. Uh, you know, I'm trying to raise money for my local basketball team. We're trying to uh, go to this tournament, tournament in Las Vegas. We don't have enough money to get us to the tournament. We need new uniforms. So we're selling these candy bars as a way to fundraise for our team so all the kids can go to, to Las Vegas to go to this basketball tournament. Would you mind supporting our cause and just buying a candy bar? And I, what, what does someone like me say? That kid told me why it is they're doing rather than what it is he's doing. I, you know what I tell the kid usually? Hey, I'll buy the whole box from you. Go get another box and sell it as quick as you can. You know, I care about why they're doing these things, okay? It's all about why. So um, if you guys ever have time to go to YouTube, look up, uh, look up Start With Why, okay? Look up Start With Why. It's a guy by the name of Simon Sinek. He did a TED Talk uh, that's titled Start With Why. And uh, on, the, on, on YouTube, you'll be able to find it. But what he does is he comes up with this theory, okay? It's a golden circle theory. And inside the circle, you see the word why. And then outside the next circle says how. And outside the next uh, circle says what, okay? And what he's trying to tell us to do is always start with why. Most people start from the outside in. We should start from the inside out. Okay, we can let people know why it is we do what we do, how exactly we do it, and what exactly we're, we're doing. And that's what's important. When most people start from the outside in, this is what I do, this is how I do it, would you like to be a part of it? No. You, you know, 99% of the time, people who start from the outside in never get to why. And if you ever caught your, catch yourself, you can reflect back on what you're doing and the way you're talking to people. Do you ever really to tell people why you're doing things? Or you just tell them what you're doing, how to do it, would you like to get involved? So you have to understand this theory right now, this golden circle theory about starting with why. Like if someone were to say, what, did it, what do you do uh, for a living, Calvin? I'm a professional network marketer. Really, I haven't really, I don't really know what that is. Can you tell me a little bit more about what it is exactly? Sure, and I can have my own reason. And everybody has a different reason of why, right? Hey, well, you know, since I was a young kid, I've always dreamt of being an entrepreneur. And as I got older and developed skills, I eventually was able to become an entrepreneur and become very, very successful. And one of my passions has been to help other people become entrepreneurs, help other people free themselves financially by starting their own business. And I know how expensive it is to start, start your own business nowadays. So I actually found a business model that makes sense to people so I could take literally anybody plug them into a, into a business, teach them the skills to become successful and they can become successful. And the business that I found was network marketing. And I never knew about network marketing before, the power that it had, but I met some people who were successful. I learned from them the skills and I became successful myself. And recently I found a company called Jeunesse Global which has some amazing product lines. I can't find a person that looks at our products that can't find a product you know, that that, that fits who we are and whoever it is. I could say I'm with prepaid legal, you know, and you know, and I, I recently found a company called prepaid legal that offers a service that's amazing. People actually use it every single month and it's worthwhile talking about, you know, so there's all these different, I could plug in any company, company X, Y, and Z, but the thing was, I started with why, right? I told them a little bit about who I was and what my dream was starting as a kid, what my passion was in developing entrepreneurs. I, the next thing was how. How I found, this, uh, I found the industry that could help these people who wanted to become entrepreneurs and start their own business. It was called network marketing. And then what? The business that I found that I really like is this company. And it could be any company, right? There are hundreds of companies out there. Whichever company you are, that's the what, that's the end. So what happens is now your words fall on conscious ears. That person could say to me, Calvin, I'm looking to start my own business. I have a friend who's interested in, 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 in starting their own business. Tell me a little bit more about your company or what this company is. Now they know why you're doing it, they're more willing to hear what it is now. Now you get the what at the end. That's what it's about. Hey, I could be, you could be a single mom saying, hey, you know what? You know, what do you do for a living? Hey, I'm a professional network marketer. Really, what is that exactly? Well, you know, uh, like most people who have to go out and work 
work all day. I don't have time to do that. You know, I have to take my kids to school and pick them up. So I needed to find something that I could do on my own time, make my own hours and make as much money as I could to provide for my kids. You know, and I love being at home with my kids. I love helping them with their homework at night when they get home. I love being able to pick them up and take them to practice. So I was looking for a business that I could build for my home. And I found that the only business that made sense for me around what I wanted was network marketing. And when I started to research network marketing companies, I found this company by the name of, and it fits my lifestyle perfectly. My girlfriends love it. I'm able to go share this business with my friends at night while my kids are at practice. Hey, sometimes my friends come over to my home on weekends and we share the products and we, we teach the other women who are single moms you know how to, how to do the business. We empower them to be able to get up there and build a, a lifestyle they've always wanted to create financial freedom, to be able to put their kids in private schools, whatever it is. But I started with why, right? I started with why, who I am, why I'm doing it, how, which is I found this industry that fits perfectly with what I'm looking for in alignment with my values and what I'm looking to do, network marketing, what it is, it's this company. And then I get into it. But the person listening is saying, wow, that's a single mom. You know, I'm a single mom. I have the same dreams. I didn't know that anything like that existed. And that's what it is. Okay, guys. So look at you guys learning something on here today. I hope you guys are. Share this Facebook Live. You know, there are people plugging in, plugging out. People will come, come back, you know. But what I'm trying to do is give you guys value today, okay? Starting with why. Starting with why. Hey, you could be a successful business person. And you could say, I'm a, I'm a professional network marketer. Hey, tell, tell me exactly what it is um, that is. Well, you know, I'm currently... You know, I've owned my own business for the past 15 years. I've become very successful. But what I found over the last 15 years is I've had rarely any time to spend with my families. I've watched my kids grow up. Now I have grandkids. I don't want to. I don't want to see my grandkids do the same. I want to put more time into my family and make the same type of income. So recently, I've been looking for a business that can supplement the income I made in my traditional business that can free up my time. And I've been looking for a business I can make the same exact type of income, but I can build on my own time, spend time with my grandkids. Um, spend time with my kids and get back that time that I miss when they are growing up and um, be able to build it on my own terms. And I found this industry called network marketing and I recently got involved in st starting my own business with this company. And my goal is in two years to be able to replace my income that I built over the last 15 years with my, with my company. Or you could say, hey, you know, you might be an employee. Hey, I love what I do for a living, but it takes all of my time. You know, I love what I do for a living, but I'm missing out on this. And, and I've been looking for something to replace my income. And I, and I found this industry called network marketing. And when I was researching companies that would fit my lifestyle and what I wanted to do and my goal, um, I found this company. Uh, and, and, and this is the, the company name. And my goal is in the next, you know, two years to replace my income, right? So I started with why, how, what. That's what it is. And you're able to now tell it is exactly what you do, but now your words are falling on conscious ears and you're more likely to get responses, questions asked back rather than just saying, I'm a professional network marketer and the person stumped and they ask what it is you do. Oh, I do, you know, D D doTERRA or whatever this company is, Young Living, whatever it is, you know, and um, it doesn't make sense to do it. So start with, start with why, okay guys? So there's the first lesson for today. The second lesson for today is just now that you're learning how to tell your why, you're getting more into your story, you have to be able to tell your story. The story is important, okay? Because the story is what's going to open up every one-on-one -on -one you do with a prospect, every two-on-one -on -one you do when you have a teammate bringing a prospect in front of you, every home meeting you do, every hotel event, everything always opens with your story. And unless you learn to tell your story, you're not going to have your words falling on conscious ear. This business has to do with people actually listening to what it is you're doing, why it is you're doing it, how it is the business works, moving them to take action, inspiring them through your story because they can see themselves in you and your story and they want to be able to get out their story and they see a real purpose in, in this and your story is what's going to motivate them. So have you ever told your story? Okay, have you ever really told it? If you haven't, you need to pick up the book GoPro by Eric Worre because in there he teaches you how to tell your story. And some of you naturally can tell your story, but some of you are not telling your story at all. Hey guys, I appreciate all the comments, all the thumbs up. Thank you so much. I'm reading them as I'm speaking, so don't worry, I notice it. I'll go back and read them after. I appreciate it, guys. Share these, share this Facebook Live everywhere with everybody you know, okay? But look at learning to tell your story, it's it's very important. There are a few simple steps. To telling your story okay when you get up in front of the people hey thank you guys for for showing up today you guys could, could have been anywhere you know you wanted today but you decided to put your time into meeting me and learning more about what it is your friend shared with you and uh, first i want to tell you guys a little bit about myself and then we'll get into what it is and, and why it is we're doing this okay um and then and then you you tell your story and your story is really four parts okay the first part is your background that's number one your background the second part is the things you don't you didn't like about your background so what do you do for a living? What don't you like about what you do for a living? And the third thing is how network marketing or your company came to the rescue. How did it come into your life? How did you discover this industry? 
And the fourth thing is your results or how you feel about your future. You know, where will this, where will this business take you into the future? Or what has it already done for you? That's your story. And simply, I swear to you, in like two to three minutes, your story is told. Now the people are, are in the front of their seats now. Wow, this is this guy's story. That's amazing. Through this business, now I want to listen to what it is it is. that, he, that What it is he's going to share with us today. Or what it is she's going to share with us today. It's telling your story effectively, okay? You know, I could simply say, hey, you know, before getting involved in this industry, I was in the real estate and mortgage industry. I love that industry because I had some great mentors who taught me about the business. Um, I became really, really uh, successful. But very quickly, I found that it took a lot of my time. I lost a lot of relationships because I was putting all of my time into my business. And even though I had all the nice things, I had the house, I had the car, you know, I lost the relationship with a girl I was really in love with. You know, I had... You know, uh, you know, I, I never spent any time with my twin brother who was my best friend. I didn't spend any time with my family and it took a lot of my time even though I was, I was successful. Fortunately for me, a neighbor of mine shared with me this incredible business called Network Marketing which I knew nothing about. And uh, because he actually shared with me a few simple action steps to get started, I took advantage of that and I repeated that over and over again and I became extremely successful in this business. today. I'm financially free. My wife was able to leave her career as, as, a, as a hairdresser. I have four beautiful children and go to private schools. Uh, we travel the world. It's an amazing life. You know, and that, that's my story, you know. And so I want to show you in the next 30 minutes what it is I'm so excited about. And then I get into the presentation. It's as simple as that. That was like a minute long, right? I could, I could not be as successful as I am today. I could say, hey, you know, uh, you know, before network marketing, I was involved in the real estate business. I had an incredible time in that industry. I loved what I did for a living, but it took all of my time. Had no time to spend with people that, that I really cared about. Um, I was making the money, but inside I was dying. I didn't, I, I didn't really love my life even though I was successful in my business. Fortunately for me, a neighbor of mine shared with me network marketing. He shared with me some products I really enjoyed that I really saw value in and sharing with people. Uh, you know, and, and you know, I recently got started a couple months ago and I see myself in this business two to three years from now replacing the income I make in my real estate business and I'm already having some success. I've built a team of about 10 to 15 people right now and we keep growing every single week and uh, all I'm doing is just sharing the opportunity, sharing products with people and people are really receptive. They're excited about this company that's just growing and growing every single day. Simple as that. I want to show you, you know, and I want to show you what it is in the next 30 minutes of what I'm so excited about and then I get into my presentation. So. What is your story? Share your story. Your background, the things you don't like about your background or the things you didn't like about your background, how network marketing or your company came to the rescue, and then your, the results you've had so far or, or the, the results you will have, where you see this business taking you. That's your story, guys. And when you learn to tell your story, now you're opening up these people, you're inspiring these people to take action in their own life now. Wow, if she could take action, so can I. If he could take action, so have I. He hasn't had the results yet, but he has a vision. I need to follow someone with a vision right now because no one I follow right now has a vision, okay? The evolution of becoming a, a, a network marketing professional is eventually being able to speak in front of people, speak in public. I took a public speaking class my third week after I started this business. I spent $800 for a three-day course and I was more confident when I left that course than I was when I, be, when I came in because I knew that nobody out there had done that. And nobody out there was going to take the step to get up and tell their story or get up and share the presentation. So the fact that I did that little thing, it raised my confidence now. And now I can get in front of people knowing that I'm this, this much ahead of all of them. And I wasn't afraid to do that, guys. Okay, But the evolution of becoming a speaker right, it, it, it comes to many stages. Okay, One, you have to learn how to tell your story. That's the first evolution of becoming an incredible speaker. The next thing is learning your standard opportunity presentation. You have to learn how to give your presentation. And it, you, you, can, you can find people who are successful. You can find a presentation that you like of someone in your business and just duplicate that. Create your own twist on it or just practice on your own if you don't have an example and make your own. Yours becomes now the standard presentation that people want to follow. And then the third step of the evolution of becoming a speaker in this business is just learning the different pr training presentations. There are different types of trainings. Learning how to just give those presentations, those training presentations to your team, whether it's a getting started training, a staying started training, a, 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 a train the trainer training session, a product training, right, a speaker's training, whatever it is, a business training, a back office training. Learning those different uh, trainings, guys, and that's what it's about, all right? So that's it. So now, today on this Facebook Live, you learn how to start with why, start from the inside out, you start with why, then how, then what, and then on this last part was just simply 
telling your story. If you don't know how to tell your story, you need to learn how to do it now. Pick up a copy of GoPro by Eric Worre. Go through those four steps that I talked to you guys about and just put it into practice. Don't worry about messing up. You're going to get better. It's your story. So be comfortable with it. Be honest. Be genuine up there. Be transparent. People are going to be moved and inspired to take action because now your story is motivating them to actually listen to your presentation now. So tell your story and then get involved in evolving yourself as a speaker through just learning to tell your story, learning your standard uh, uh, opportunity presentation, and then learning the different training presentations that, you're, that, that you need to help people become successful in your company. All right, guys? So I appreciate you guys just jumping on today. I appreciate you guys sharing the shit, Facebook Live. Give me some thumbs up if you guys learned every, anything today. You guys are on the 90-day run. Keep running, keep running. The finish line is in sight, guys. Okay, if you guys have any questions, I'd be happy to answer that for you guys right now. Otherwise, we're going to sign off from this 90-day run Facebook Live. I look forward to seeing you guys again next Wednesday morning at 9 a.m. sharp. Let people know about this Facebook Live. Anybody in the industry can join. If you guys want to see any of my past Facebook Lives for the 90-day run, all you have to do is go to the90dayrun.com, T-H-E 90-D-A-Y. Dot com. You can go there and get all the generic training tools. You can get the, the, the build the list on there. You can get all the scripts when talking to people. You can, go, you can see all the page with all of my Facebook lives for the past weeks that the 90 day run is, go, is going on and just learn and train yourself and share those videos. Learn some of my training and go train it yourself to your team. Take it as yours. Own it because I learned from other people who were successful in this business. Now I'm able to share information uh, with you guys. I learned from taking action. I learned from all of my failures and now I've, I've been able to adjust my sale and become successful because I get back up every time and I'm able to share with you guys the ways to success. So again, have a great Wednesday, you guys, whether you're at, you're at work or whether you're at home, whether you're on vacation or whether you just woke up. Have a great, uh, have a great run, guys. I'll see you guys next Wednesday. Thank you, Marta, for putting the website up there. There it is, the 90 run.com. There you go. You, you can get a bunch of tools on there. Get those videos, share them like crazy. I love you guys. Good luck. God bless.